Hi, this is WeWork. This is me, Mark Barbosa, and this is the rest of the team. And that's why we are so different. This is traditional e-commerce. And that's uh, BeWork, where we have sellers, resellers, buyers, and we can swap, recommend, and negotiate items with friends, neighbors, or all the Facebook network. <laughs> 15 seconds. <laughs> Guten Tag. My name is Mark Barbosa, and I'm here to present the next revolution of e-commerce. This is BeWork. So we believe in Mark Zuckerberg. Uh, he said that uh, if he had to guess, social commerce is the next area to really blow up. And uh, who we are. So what we do is try to combine the social uh, networks concepts with e-commerce concepts. And then we want to bring the old essence of uh, the marketplace where people uh, swap uh, potatoes, uh, with other things and try to negotiate the price and that kind of stuff. So, um, wait, 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 wait. So we found two big problems uh, with e-commerce. Uh, a problem in the market and uh, a problem uh, for the users. As a problem, technology. Uh, as a problem for the market, e-commerce is still uh, limited to buy and sell. Uh, actually, it's very difficult to, to try to negotiate a price, to swap uh, my jacket for a PlayStation, for example, or even to resell other stuff to, to my friends. There is insufficient data to prevent what users want. And um, interestingly, products, websites, news sources, and search engines drive less than 15% of trust. A problem for the user. When I, when I go to Craigslist or when I go to, to eBay, there is a rating, okay, but I cannot see the, the face of the person, I cannot see the name. I cannot see the, the mutual friend, so I can ask them, I can I trust this guy or not? Uh, there is a sharing problem. When I post some item, it easily uh, disappears in, the, um, in the, the, the amount of the, the items there. So, as a market solution, we, we want to lead e-commerce to a new P, of the four P's of marketing, people. We combine uh, several big data with uh, uh, customized algorithms to, um, to improve trading experience, and we want to bring more actions to e-commerce. It's not only about sell and buy, but also about reselling, about swapping, negotiating uh, with my friends, my neighbors, or all the Facebook network. As a solution for the users, I can see there is a real people, there is a real person with real friends, I can see past transactions, I can see ratings, I can comment, I can say, don't trust this guy. About sharing, I can, if I have a huge network, I can leverage on that network to earn commissions. Like, I want to, to, to sell my iPhone, but uh, I'm willing to give 5% to who gets me a buyer. So I have all my network try, trying to, to get me a buyer, uh, so I don't need to, to care about that. So as uh, features, we can sell, buy, swap, or negotiate. I can resell other stuff. I, I don't need to be a buyer or seller. I can be a reseller and just uh, match the, the buyer uh, and the seller. Uh, I can check all the sales and price of, from the same product or uh, nearby. I can easily create and export uh, an online store with three clicks for a business to consumer, um, small stores doesn't need to know how to create an e-commerce solution. Um, I can follow uh, products or uh, um, users. I can recommend uh, uh, products to friends. I can create my own marketplace. It's not only about stores, but about marketplace. For example, I like fashion. I want to create a fashion marketplace in Berlin. I want to create a marketplace for another place. Uh, or I can make a wish list so my friends can uh, group buy uh, a gift for me. So there is a market opportunity. E-commerce is huge. Facebook is also huge. Um, Booz and Company predicts social commerce will grow 1,300% uh, one, uh, over the, the next years. And the top 10 US venture capital al already invest uh, almost two billion. So this is why we are different. We have resales, we have swap and negotiate thing, and we have wish lists. So um, this is how, how, how it looks uh, right now. 
Um, these recommendations I can buy. So this is our development team. Uh, my name is uh, I'm Marco. There is Miguel and Afonso. We, we strongly believe uh, this is the right team. And uh, that this is some of uh, team achievements before. We have one exit and uh, several awards. This is our facts until now. We have um, more than 35,000 users uh, growing uh, organically without any advertising costs or marketing efforts. It's just organic. Uh, this is our next steps. We, are, we will launch a new iPhone app. We already have one. Uh, revenue streams, group buying, uh, translation to, to German. And um, this is one of the studies of the new look. And Panke, Berlin. <laughs> All right, big up, be work it. So when I bought this bow tie here, I already shared it with my Twitter and Facebook followers. And mm -hmm. I got a lot of comments, people liked it. Why can't you just add this on to that data that I'm already sharing on my existing networks? Uh, I don't, uh, so why would I, I why, why would I share it on your platform? Why yes. couldn't I just share it on networks that I already have? Yes, but uh, you are limited to your followers. Okay, here you can take advantage of uh, another networks that can give you buyers, and uh, that way you are not just limited to your followers. Like if you say you want to to, to sell that, and you are willing to give one percent of that to get you a buyer you will see a lot of people outside of your network trying to sell it for you. Got it. Judges. Okay, so there's a lot of things I'd like to comment on, but uh, there's a saying like doing one thing well, and you seem to be doing a lot of things. Yes, so yes. as a user, I just like, I almost lost myself when you keep saying, and you can also, and you can also. So how do you, how do you manage that, and why do you do that, seriously? Uh, okay, uh, that, that's a, a real problem. We, we went to several months to Silicon Valley s some months ago, and um, they, they said us the, the same thing. Now, we want to launch a new product, uh, very, very simple. For now, we have this, and we are trying to, to understand what people uh, do more. We, we, we leverage several solutions. And we, we want to focus on our next product. What's the one, the three or four uh, features that really uh, uh, works? And then we can um, gradually uh, put more actions. For now, we have this, a public beta. We are testing the market. We are trying to understand how the users want to use it. Um, but uh, it, okay. we want to fix that. Well, that sounds perfect. And just follow up a question. What is, what is the the typical use case, what are people interested in, in swapping or buying or selling? Um, there is a, a lot of people interested in reselling, because I, 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 don't, I don't want, for example, uh, when I say I'm willing to give 5%, um, you as a reseller, you can, you, you, you can choose only to earn 1%, and then you can drop the price and resell to a friend. So what we have is three people, Usually we, we have three people uh, in a transaction because if a friend of mine uh, um, is selling a, an iPhone and I have another one that, uh, and I want to buy it, I ask a friend to resell it and he takes no commission. So uh, I have it cheaper. So that, that's what usually uh, happens there. And we, uh, we have users and uh, business to consumer stores. We have about uh, 500 <coughs> business to consumer stores. Uh, they export to fan page and then they interact with uh, their followers. Okay. So I think you, you definitely have to have to focus uh, uh, product-wise and also potentially market-wise. So uh, do you have a, a, a vertical in, in, in mind that, that would be a, a good start for, for you based on, on the, the traction that you have already got? Mm -hmm. Uh, I mean, it, you, you have you have thirty-five thousand users or so. So yes. uh, the one uh, one uh, thing to focus on is uh, uh, one more vertical that you all already see in your user group uh, getting mm -hmm. some traction. So so is yes, there it's you... our focus now. We don't have for now. We don't have a lot of marketing or advertising. We have growth strategies that we have implemented and that allow us to grow uh, very fast. Uh, without uh, spending uh, money. No, but but uh, which vertical market would be potentially a good start based on what what you what you see uh, on traction on your on your marketplace so far? 
I mean, is it is it is it fashion potentially or 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 cars uh, okay, okay, or? Okay. Uh, uh, there is there is a lot of a lot of people trying to to sell uh, cars, uh, electronics, and uh, fashion clothes. Yeah, are uh, are our biggest uh, uh, item categories are these three. So there is cars. Uh, some people put houses and uh, so we, we let people to, to put everything, but clothes, uh, electronics, computers, and uh, uh, smartphones and uh, um, uh, cars. Okay. Okay, so a couple super quick things. Number one, I have a presentation on SlideShare on how to pitch. You should go watch it. Um, okay. You, there were way too many words. I don't actually know really what you do. I can't tell if you guys are an e-commerce site, if you're an affiliate site, if you're taking on Craigslist. Like, it's kind of that whole focus thing, right? So try to figure out how to really communicate what it is, the value that you're driving to the consumer, because right now I have no idea. Um, you actually have a product, like you have 35,000 users. I didn't know that until the end. The whole time I thought this was a concept. And then at the end you're like, and we have 35,000 users. I was like, wow, you should have started with that. Show me the product, don't tell me about it. You walk me through all these words and I was like, this is totally not real. And then I got to the end and I was like, oh wow, it is kind of real, cool. So like, think, like, I think if you walk people through the product a little bit, it's gonna be a lot easier to communicate what it is that you do okay. and who it is that you're targeting and what the value is to the consumer. Start there because I think the whole time most of us were really confused. <laughs> okay, okay. okay. And, um, and it wasn't until I think the end that we sort of started to get it, so. Okay, thank you. Feedback. Thank you. Uh, no, okay. okay, speechless. You are speechless. Okay, okay. Thank you. We, we know who Mark Zuckerberg is. You can take that slide out. Okay. Thank you. <laughs>